Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum again. So today again we are standing in front of another lab of mechanical and manufacturing engineering. Today we are in front of heat transfer lab. It also has the portion of thermodynamics and renewable energies. So today we have Dr. Lukman with us and he is the in charge of the lab along with his team and he will give us a round of the lab. Dr. Yeah, welcome. Uh, I'm Dr. Mohammed Lukman, and uh, I'm basically mechanical engineer, but PhD in sustainable energy. So let's have a visit of the, our lab. Let's uh, have. This is our heat transfer lab, and uh, she is our. Uh, Please introduce yourself. Yeah. I am Maryam Khalid. I have done my engineering from UET Peshawar. Yeah. So let's start with our. Uh, so basically, this is a. Uh, basic lab for our mechanical engineering students and this is basically to demonstrate the basic concepts of uh, heat transfer and thermodynamics and also we have some uh, demonstra uh, demonstrative uh, you know uh, some cycles as well so uh, to start with uh, we have this heat conduction unit uh, which is basically to uh, demonstrate the conduction process and here we can measure the thermal conductivity of uh, different uh, materials and then uh, we also have uh, different uh, equipment for radiation heat transfer measurement and we also have the convective heat transfer equipment there uh, which is used to demonstrate the uh, concept of different modes of heat transfer and here uh, then we have the heat exchangers uh, this is lead and heat exchanger and this this is uh, shell and tube heat exchanger and this one is uh, double pipe heat exchanger for uh, demonstrating the heat exchanger in its process then we have some uh, these two equipment which are used for uh, Heating different fluids. Uh, this is block piles condensation unit and this is boiling unit, uh, and it has like uh, uh, demonstrative capacities of uh, uh, understanding different uh, boiling regimes. Then if we move on. This is uh, a demonstrative apparatus for uh, mechanical heat pump, uh, having uh, all the equipments, and this is uh, a refrigeration cycle, uh, basically vapor compression cycle. Uh, is operated uh, with uh, R134 uh, refrigerant. Uh, let's move on. These are two uh, this is pressure and temperature calibration units. So uh, this is pressure and this is uh, temperature measurement uh, units and calibration units. If we move on, uh, this is expansion process unit where we can uh, demonstrate the expansion of different fluids. Mm -hmm. and this is uh, solar energy uh, uh, system demonstrator in which we can demonstrate the energy produced through solar panels. We can have uh, measurements of different uh, uh, ampere, this uh, current and voltages. Yeah. So this is basically our uh, whole uh, basic lab. We also have the steam power plant uh, demonstrator uh, where we can demonstrate the uh, main components of the, the steam power plant. So uh, in future we are planning to develop some more advanced labs uh, which will be used for uh, our graduate courses uh, which may include for example the renewable energy uh, systems dedicated lab and some other uh, thermodynamics advanced labs. So I hope uh, this was enough for today. And okay, you know. thank you very much Dr. Lukman and Engineer Mariam. That was a very informative session. Okay, so that's all for, for the visit of the lab. We talked to Dr. Lukman for his research fields and how you can connect with him. Yeah, so uh, this was a basic demonstration of our lab. Uh, in future, we are planning to develop some uh, more advanced labs, for example, uh, renewable energy systems lab, and uh, there will be some applied uh, uh, lab for food production system, which will be like controlled environment agricultural system, uh, integrated with hydroponics and aquaponics systems. And uh, uh, we mainly work on uh, developing sustainable food supply chains, starting from the food production to uh, consumers' delivery. I hope to see you soon, all of you. Yeah. Okay, so this, this was the basic lab and engineering students, when you will come here, you will learn the basic principles from here and then you'll start working with some of the specialists in some specific applied fields, which are mostly coming from the industry. And that would end you up in an entrepreneurial, entrepreneurial role or you will be serving in an industry. So thank you very much, all of you, and see you again in, in a new lab of mechanical and manufacturing engineering. Allah Hafiz. Thank you.